Uh, Ronald Reagan said the closest thing to eternal life on earth is a government program. The deep state exists. It is a bureaucracy. It's, we, we call that the bureaucracy. Um, the bureaucracy compounds the bureaucracy. Bureaucrats have to create jobs for themselves, and then they have to justify its own, their own creation. This is why DEI exists, by the way. Why do you have DEI officers in Lee County schools? Why do you have DEI officers in businesses? Because somebody decided, oh, we need to do compliance here. And so they create a DEI program. And that DEI program serves no, so serves no purpose except to perpetuate its self-existence. And in this case, it's, there's racism in the schools. We have to combat racism, so we have to create a DEI officer. And then that person gets paid a $100,000 salary to do absolutely nothing except to create more of the racism narrative. But I would extend that analogy to most federal government programs that are not accountable directly to the people. So the president has control of the secretaries. He can appoint the secretary. So at least there's some appointment to the president. But under all of those secretaries are legions of staff at the DOD, the DOE, the DOJ. And their job in Northern Virginia is solely to perpetuate their own existence. How hard is it, even if we said, even if we gave a public mandate to the federal government to dole out funds for schools, let's say we passed a $190 billion authorization for schools, which we did during the pandemic. It was called the Pandemic ESSA Relief Funding. Um, it's, you should just be able to just click a button and then the money would just go directly to the schools and there should be no administrators or middlemen in between. Instead, you have 10% of that money going to the administrators who are literally in charge of giving out the money. It is not that hard to give out money, guys. That is what the deep state is. And then worse yet, when you tie in the fact that some of these people actually have agendas and that they are not elected, um, but they are treated as if they're a self-perpetuating existence, that's when you get the deep state, and that is what is hurting our country right now.